There are so many skis in the world. There's one for every skiing style, snow conditions, terrain. It's endless. So how do you build something different? You start from the beginning. As engineers, we looked at this with fresh eyes and a new perspective, and we peeled back the layers beyond the wood cores, beyond the ski shapes, beyond the layout materials. That's all stuff you've heard before. We came across this non-Newtonian polymer, polyborough dimethyl siloxane, which is just a fancy way of saying a material which feels stiffer as it's exposed to vibrations, right? It just adapts to snow conditions. It's one of those things that we knew was gonna work, but it still took us four years of R&D of different layups and formulations to find the right one. We knew what it could do, we just had to perfect it. So much of a ski's performance is based on stiffness, right? It's one of the most important attributes of a ski. This polymer changes how stiff or soft the ski feels automatically in real time. We developed a process for embedding this material inside the actual core of a pair of skis. And by applying varying levels of vibration, we were able to model the core's reaction time and flexibility. It's the shape of the molecule, which under normal conditions feels soft and pliable, yet as vibrations increase, feels more and more stiff and stable. Outside on the snow, the results were even more profound. There are times you want a stiff and stable ski, and there are times you want a soft and playful ski. This polymer bridges that gap and gives you a little bit of both. We're the only ones to do this, and the first ones to ever put this inside of a pair of skis. Every ski vibrates, and as you ski faster and faster, the ski shakes more. That's just physics, that's how the ski world works. But not anymore, 